Hey guys, Dark Matthew Silver here, bringing you a companion spotlight about Xena, the warrior princess. Xena is one of the most useful muskets in the game. Because she has three abilities and six epics. Making her the only companion in the game to actually have six. For now, that is. To start, she has a super hit, critical strike, Sadly, not an epic hit, but it is still useful for assassination, or just trying to kill someone. Her main epics to, uh, not epics, abilities to talk about will be her reign of fire. It creates an, an X flames on the board to act as a barrier, or a massive damage dealer, and depending on what team you're in. If you're in red, use it as a massive damage dealer, and if you're in blue, use it as a defense. They act as a massive damage dealer because they deal percentage damage, so they all add up pretty rapidly. As you can see, with the boss, it only does 12, but that's because its health isn't all that massive. If it were to, to be done on a companion with a health, like somewhere near 3000, it would deal over 100. Pretty close to 200, actually. Her, her epics include Return Fire and Double Tap, which is the epic she will get start with when, when you first get her. And also, she can learn Quick Draw, Overwatch, and Burst Fire. So she's the only companion that can actually make use of Triple Burst Fire. In fact, I think she's the only good musket that actually can use it because Bonnie can't learn it anymore, sadly. So, yeah, definitely give it to her. You can, you can give her a quick draw or overwatch. I gave her overwatch because I'm a witch doctor and typically it's a good day to take an overwatch. As for her appearance, she looks like a better version of an Archean Amazon Archer. Since she's the warrior princess, so she has a crown and also her eyes look better. And I think her bow looks better too. I don't really know the difference because I haven't seen one in quite a while. To get her, you need to do a really large chain of quests that start with getting it from Frontinus and Archaea, Aquila. And after that, you can pretty much just use her for PvP, because you get it, you want to get her at when you're level 65. Because that makes it a lot easier, and she'll be level 67 by the time you get her. Her usefulness in PvP is pretty dang obvious, because you'll see Xenos everywhere. Since she's a really popular muscle to use, and if you're you, and if you're smart, you'd use her too. And it's why everyone uses her. Her one downfall is that she has a range of four because of the fact that she has a bow instead of a gun. And why I can't hit the fires over in the back, which is five to, five steps away. You can compensate this by using the range of fire to extend her range by one. So you can hit someone five five steps away. That's one way to use it. Because she only has a range of four, she's very susceptible to getting blown up by musket lines and splash covers too. But it's not much of a problem. That's pretty much it for Xena. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to Teen and Green Nation. Check out our Twitter and Facebook. This is Dark Matthew Silver, and I'll see you next time.